So what you have to do to change text box size in Illustrator, it's quite simple. But if if it's frustrating, if you're doing it the right the, the wrong way. Just grab text and just click and now type. And there's two ways you can also hold control and now drag and now you can increase the box size or you can also go to selection tool and now you're selecting and grabbing but i don't know if this is still available this if you can still have this glitch but if i go here and text and you see now is not uh, changing its size now i'm not an expert i know exactly what's the reason i might might be a glitch or an arrow but yeah and it's like if, even if now you type something it's still gonna it's not going to change its size the way we want you know but if you are in text and you still i mean you can still you can change its size from here as well but yeah it's uh it's sometimes it's frustrating you can also change go to transform click on scale and here you have the option for scaling but it's not the now you can also go to window here and here in uh, properties now you can also just highlight if this method is not working um so you're trying to you know like this or this is working but for this one that is still not working you can go to character and just um increase the value here enter maybe 300 so so just enter here and also click on this if you like to just highlight here right that's another way can enter here 200 you know 300 that's another way but the faster way in my opinion is just click select hold control and just resize it and it's much faster. Hold control right while, while, while you are in text. Now, if you go to keyboard shortcuts and here in the search bar, you write. Now here, if you go to many commands and other text, sorry, here, other text, you can also Increase the text by using this shortcut point size up shift plus control plus dot and uh, to point size now point size down you see here the shortcut and that's another way shift control so let's test as you can see it works and down it works down as well. So that's a basically another method, but I do not use this method. But if you found this helpful, much helpful at the other methods, you can use this one. It's up to you. All right. So thank you so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe for more tutorials. And if you have any, any other questions or suggestions for the next Adobe Illustrator tutorial, let me know in the comment section. I'll create a tutorial for you. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.